It's your girl Gia. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Really appreciate all your feedback here. And as you know, it does take some time and effort to get these videos done. So I really appreciate you going down there, hitting that like button, subscribing to my YouTube channel. We're gonna be getting into how to get through or how to burn stubborn fat. And I'm gonna tell you some of the tips that has helped me when I was competing on stage and also when I have to regularly get ready for shoots and lean out. I always stay within seven to 10 pounds. Um, so it's easy for me to get uh, ready for a shoot within seven to 14 days. Um, and I'm going to show you three things that have helped me. The first one is understanding your macros, understanding how much energy you are putting out with your workouts and your daily activities and how much energy you are consuming with your nutrition, your fats, your calories, your carbs. If you are consuming more calories than you are actually giving out per day, you will store body fat. That is something you don't have to take my word for. You can do a little bit of research, it's science backed. So I have actually linked in something down in the description. You can download the First Form Transformation app and it's super simple. All you gotta do is describe the food that you're eating and it will actually track all your macros for you for the day, per day, every day, for as long as you need. So you can, you can actually track and see what you're doing. Uh, and then also your workouts. It can uh, give you your workouts and tell you how many calories you are expending every single day. So that is the first step. Number two would be your cardio. Uh, fasted cardio for me has been what has worked for me in the morning with just a little bit of caffeine. I don't put anything in my coffee that can spike insulin. So if you were to put a protein shake or something like this, you'll spike the insulin and then you would lose that effect. So just a little bit of coffee. Um, I'm also going to show at the end of this video some products if you don't like coffee that really work well the same way. And then fasted cardio, 35 to 45 minutes in the morning, then I would come back and I would have my first whole meal, another three hours later, another whole meal, and then I would go back again for resistance training. And then the third and final tip is you will burn maximum calories by lifting weights versus a steady state cardio. There are reasons why steady state cardio is good, but you also want to be implementing other ways of conditioning. Um, you could be doing your weightlifting, you can be doing high intensity interval training, um, but you want to be implementing different type of training to really get the maximum amount of calories burned per day and also lean out the quickest, most effective way. We'll give you a workout next, so come with me. I'm going to show you a great resistance training. And then at the end of the video, don't miss out because I'm going to be showing you some supplements that have really helped me.
I wanted to, before I head out, show you my products that I use that have really helped me when I'm leaning out. One would be the Mega Watt. This is a pre-workout, and if you're not into coffee in the morning, I definitely suggest doing a scoop of this in your water before you head off to a workout. It's gonna make you work out amazing. It gives you an amazing pump as well. Then when I would come back, I take a fat burner, and fat burners are very different than pre-workouts. I've done a little explanation in the description down below along with all these products so you guys can understand the differences. And then last but not least is my level one protein. protein. This very versatile protein, it can be mixed in basically anything and does not require a mixer. You can even use a spoon. Very easy to mix. Protein pancakes, coffee, mug cakes, it's endless. <laughs> If you're following me on my Instagram page, you'll see some of the, the cookie dough recipes and all sorts of things that I make with it. So this is a must. Um, yeah, I hope this video helped, guys. If you have questions, don't forget to leave them down below. I will get to them. Really appreciate all your support here on my YouTube channel. And until next time, we'll see you all soon.